Good morning. Today is Wednesday, May the 17th, 2017, about 8.10. It's 68 degrees. It's going to be another hot day. we got to go into town this afternoon and do some shopping. Now he's off to get breakfast somewhere. Said he was tired of parties. He's waving. It took me about 15 minutes to cut all the dead blossoms off this planter. I deadheaded this planter yesterday. It takes so long and it's kind of warm out here, so I just do one at a time. I finished cleaning the door and the, and the frame. These doors are all done. Here's an update on how Larry's tomatoes have grown. That's, that's the one that lays the eggs for the worm. Oh, that white moth there? Yep. Is the one that lays eggs and makes uh, tomato worms? Mm -hmm. There's a bunch of them flying around. Cabbage worms. Cabbage worms. You see, they're up, the tomatoes are up higher than the string. Your zucchini is just getting bigger and bigger, the leaves. It's like a tropical plant. That needs to be picked. Larry pick. pulled up all the kale. I'm going to plant something else in there. Looks like his onions are growing. Larry had a turnip come up in the kale, so he pulled it for me. I like raw turnips. We got green beans there. In the middle of the flowers. Yeah. In, in amongst the zinnia plants that come up volunteer. Wow, that's a big worm. Tomato worm. He's a tomato worm. That's the end of him. For night. He ate half that little tomato. And the leaves. Oh, here's another big one. Eat the leaves and the tomatoes. Mm -hmm. See it better like that, probably. The horn. Yeah. See the There's horn a third the worm. Yuck. I should use seven dust, but I'm not going to do it. I don't like to put that. There's another one hiding down under the leaf. They're easy to miss. That's one of my Mr. Stripey tomatoes. He went and ate the side of it. Stupid worm. All right, cut the top and bottom off the turnip. Now he's got the sink over here by the outside to probably wash the dirt off of it. Probably won't be enough to eat. Yeah, it'll be about right. Grapes are growing. These are the red seedless grapes. All the ones down through here are muscadines. My moss rose are still doing great. Larry loaned Steffi the pump for pumping out her pool. Now he's going to put back in his to pump more water. You got a red dot? Yeah. Well, here at Murphy's, now he's going to pour up the gas. On the way into town, we saw um, three police cars go flying the other direction toward home. It was on the main road. And then once we got here in town, Lowry saw two more. I was in at the uh, hardware store returning some batteries. I stopped by the drugstore right Aid and picked up my medicine. The cholesterol. We're done at Walmart. Here we are back at the bank, just for a minute or two. We stopped at Arby's. They have the dollar menu between two and five, so we got milkshakes and and a fry and two sliders. We're on our way to church. We got Bible study tonight. We can see what the preacher has to say. It's a beautiful evening. Here we are at church. It's 8.12.
well when we're home from Bible study. The sun was pretty on the way here, but it's gone down now. Uh, the pastor and I uh, had people with different versions of the Bible to read uh, 2 Timothy 2.15. And he talked about the importance of in-depth Bible study and not just reading, but the study in the Bible. So that was good to hear. And all those police cars we saw this afternoon, it turns out there's, they found, uh, I don't know if somebody was murdered or just found a dead body uh, down on the road close to where Larry used to manage a plantation. So we'll go watch the news to find out more about it. Good night. God bless.